Assalamu alaikum guys, what's up? Yeah, I might look really funny right now because I'm not wearing any makeup and I'm not feeling well But today I wanted to shoot a makeup tutorial for you guys I'm gonna be trying to do a smoky eye kind of look I'm gonna try to use only two or three eyeshadows I'm gonna list every single thing down below Like if I don't show you guys the products I'm just gonna list them down below and you can find them in the description box I've already moisturized my face, I've already primed my face We're gonna start off with doing our eyebrows As you can see, my eyebrows are so so thin. Anastasia Beverly Hills Dip Brow in the shade Chocolate. I just like going on the bottom and the top and just following what I already have, but obviously making it look better. Now I'm gonna go ahead with foundation. So for this, I'm using Huda's foundation. I only need like one pump or like maximum two for my face. Squirt some onto my beauty blender and then I'm gonna go and dot it on my face. One, two, three, four, five. I literally had one squirt and like, look at this. This is why I feel so weird doing makeup on camera cause like, it gets all over my scarf. Okay. Look at that, like, look at, look at this coverage. That's so much. Now we're just gonna literally spread this out on our entire face. So we have our foundation on. I'm gonna go and contour. For contouring, I'm using this stick. I don't contour my forehead because I have a really small forehead already. Bring it in. There. I don't usually contour my nose, but I feel like during pregnancy, my nose has gotten a little like swollen. So underneath, and then from the top down, from the top down. We're gonna go with the same beauty blender and blend that in. So I'm gonna go in with concealer on my eyelids. I'm gonna put some setting powder on top of that. And then we are gonna go in with our eyeshadows directly on our eyeballs. For this, I don't like using a brush. I just like going in with my finger because I just feel like it's just so much better. So we have a concealer on our eyelids. Now we're gonna go set that in. I have the Tarte contour palette and I'm gonna be using the little powder on the corner in Halo to set my eyelids. Now we're gonna go in with our eyeshadows. I'm using my Naked Heat Palette transition color. Your transition color should not be too dark and it should not be too light. right underneath it. It's called ashes. Putting that into our outer corner. Now to pop up some glitter, we are gonna be using the Kylie Jenner palette in the shade Morocco. I can't show it to you guys because some of these shades are actually falling out. So and then we're gonna go right where we didn't put anything else. That's how our eye looks right now. I'm gonna go do the other eye just like this one off camera and I'll be right back. So I just did my other eye off camera and now we are going to go in with some eyeliner I am using. I don't even know, it's like faded out. I think it's L'Oreal. It's just those liquid eyeliners. I like doing both my eyeliners at the same time. Okay, and the same thing on the other side. As long as these two lines match, you're good. Now you just wanna bring the corner down. Fill it in. Okay. 
Now we are going to go in with mascara, random mascara that I stole from my mom. But I usually do not wear that much mascara because I wear a lot of lash extensions. I don't like putting mascara on them. I only like doing this because we're gonna be wearing our lashes on top. The lashes that I'm using today are bomb. Why? Because they're mine. Have you guys ever wondered what life would be like if there was no makeup? Guys would have to marry girls without makeup. Girls would have no makeup. Like, life would be so weird. The bombest lashes of all time. The official launch is happening on the 1st of January, 2020. You will be getting these lashes real, real soon. This is what it looks like. By the way, this lash is called Majesty. I know, right? That is what it's gonna look like. Boom. Look at the difference. I'm gonna put some glue on this, I'm gonna pop off these lashes, and I'll be right back. All right, so I put my lashes on. We're going to put concealer under our eyes, clean up the excess eyeshadow that we have like underneath the eyeliner. So on this side, if you notice, eyeshadow here. I'm gonna conceal that and clean that up on both sides. I'm gonna put some concealer on my chin as well. And we're gonna blend that in. So my camera shut off, but I blended in my concealer here. I put some underneath the contour. As you can see, the contour on both sides now is so much more cleaner. I cleaned up the eyeshadows on both sides with the concealer as well, and then also um, blended in the concealer on my forehead. Use these last two shades, and I'm going to go over the contour that I have. That's it. Take our setting powder. I'm using Veil from Hourglass. Set our concealer in place. Dot the powder everywhere we need. We're gonna clean up that line of contour again. So we're gonna set everywhere else we put our Concealer. So we just cleaned up any excess powder, set our face to go in with the shade. Lower lash line, we're gonna go in with that shade over there. And we will place that on our lower lash line. And now we're going to go in with that shade from the Kylie Jenner palette, that shimmery shade, and we will go in the inner corners as well. Just like that. Just like that. Because these lashes are so dramatic, we are going to put a little bit of mascara on the lower lash line as well because it just looks so much better. And now we are going to go in with blush. I'm using Huda Beauty's 3D Highlight Palette. I'm actually using the blush in there called Bora Bora. For the highlighter, I am using my all-time favorite highlight. It's the little mini one that I have right now, but it's Becca's Champagne Pop Fan Brush. It's our cheekbones. Highlight your cheekbone, make sure it's blended in. Tip of my nose. For the lips, I'm gonna be using my Maybelline Lip Pencil in the color Rose. First of all, we're gonna go clean our lips because there's a lot of foundation on our lips. I like putting a lip balm, like very lightly just dabbing the lip balm on. Now we're going to go and outline our lips. After you outline it, just fill it in with the same lip pencil. And that is it. This is the final look. I'm gonna use my Huda Beauty setting spray and set this makeup. The one tip I'm gonna give to every single girl out there is when you put your makeup on, after you put on your setting spray, use your beauty blender and set that setting spray in. It just puts everything into place, every single thing. And even if you wanna go over your highlight, no problem. Like lightly just tap 
everywhere on your face. This is the final look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'm gonna leave all the products that I used in this video in the link down below and you guys can grab yours. Also, do not forget, we are launching Queen Froggy Beauty on January the 1st, 2020. I feel like 2020 is gonna be my year because there's gonna be so many things that are happening, some special events while well, I'm having a baby. So 2020 is gonna be an awesome year. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Try this makeup look. Tag me on Instagram. I hope you guys have an amazing new year. If you guys have some new year's resolutions, some goals for 2020, comment below. Inshallah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Till next time, peace out.